Welcome everyone, it's the ESL live stream. Welcome to you on Facebook and Twitch today and as well on YouTube. Thanks for being here. This is the ESL live stream and we're going to go with a Q&A, of course, to help you with your class. Uh, today we're going to also see some help. Uh, as you might want to learn Chinese, I got a good friend called Karen and she's going to help you with your Chinese for your class. If you want to improve your Chinese wherever you are in this world, even in China, if you are already in China, you want to improve your Chinese, we will see that later. Uh, so, yeah, the ESL live stream. Let's go. Start it. Right now. Mike's on ESL. Bye. Welcome to all of you. Thank you for being on the live. And if you are new in here, Mike Somi ESL is an ESL teaching tips channel. So if you need help with your English class, just feel free to ask and I will help you as much as I can. Um, today it's a Q&A, so you can just write question and then your question. That will be really Awesome. And if you are not a member uh, yet, you can go under the video and join for not even two bucks, 1.99 bucks a month. If you want to be part uh, of that ESL power, you get some perks, awesome perks to reward you. And that will help me a lot to keep on creating because, you know, that's all those videos I've been doing all those years and I've been doing it myself. And now it's started to come to a point that where I have to employ some uh, uh, freelancer to help me with some editing for you to understand better uh, how to teach in your class and to have more fun. In And I really want you to love teaching. It's not only... As foreign year back in China, yeah, we all love, it's easy for us to find uh, a job as an English teacher just because bring money home. But yeah, um, I, I'd like you to get more involved into your job by giving you tips that can make you feel that, yeah, English teaching is really fun and ESL power. Because of that power, that we have to teach English, yeah, we can help other people, to, especially young kids, to start to love English, to get their interest uh, in English, so that in the future they can go wherever the country they want to go. And even if they want to stay home, they can stay at home. Uh, they will be able to, res to explain to foreigners their own culture and tradition. So that's a big message of peace and love. So really, if you want to be part of this family, just hit that join buttons. You won't regret it. Uh, you won't regret it. So thanks for being in the live uh, today Q&A. So get your questions ready. Um, I'm going to say a little hello in the chat. Who do we get tonight? Selling number one today, brother. Every day is here in the house. Hi, brother. My high is sitting. Thank, uh, Serene, sorry. <laughs> oh, man. Thanks for being in the live. That's cool. Hello, Tuyan. Thanks for being in here on Facebook. Don't forget to leave some likes. And if you are watching the replay as well, don't forget to give some likes. Thanks a lot. Uh, that will help, you know, uh, YouTube algorithm It is, is going to, more you give some likes, more is going to show, uh, is going to expand on the platform and all other teacher will be uh, teachers who need help. Remember when you needed that help. So, yeah, just help other teachers need to be all together when it comes to teaching, just for the good sake of our students, of our children, they are our future. So we got to really uh, 
be a team. So that's why I always use that ESL power. Always say that ESL power for you to feel that you get that power and you have some superpowers. You are a teacher and you're going to be proud to be a teacher. Don't, yeah, you remember when you were a student, you're like, I don't like that teachers. I don't like that. Yeah, just for me, I wasn't, I wasn't the best students in the classroom. So some of my teachers were, yeah, uh, you know, well, when you're young and all stuff, but now you're a teacher and that's the best job in the world. And you have to do it with your heart to help uh, those kids out to have a great future. A teacher is one of the most important people in your life. And I always remember my teachers when I was in primary school, even in high school and in uh, university, when I passed uh, that, that, that diploma, uh, diploma, what was that diploma? Um, a kind of vocational uh, business diploma. Not a master of business, but quite pretty close. Uh, I used to be in university, I was working and uh, you know, learning at the same time. So it, it's very important. I always remember what they were saying. And great help for sure. Thank you so much, uh, Ims Kalumba. Welcome into the live. Thank you, bro, for being back. Uh, who is in here as well? Uh, oh, uh, sorry, Dasami. Thank you, Dasami, for being in here. Where are you from? Guess. <laughs> Thanks for being new in the live. I really appreciate. You can just try to guess where I'm from. Andy, Andy, brother, ESL power, bruh, yeah, brother, thanks, he, uh, Andy, the ESL guy, most of you know him, uh, especially uh, on my Some ESL platform, because he's a partner of my channel, we are part of that ESL family as well, ESL power family, he is, he has also an awesome channel that I really recommend you to go and check it out, and don't forget to subscribe. Uh, very nice brother. I don't know. He, you know that you can come on the platform with me in the chat at any time uh, in here. The ESL live stream is your home. And uh, so that you, if you want to say something in the live, I always forget to tell you that if you want to say something in the live, um, you are very welcome. If you want to join, everybody can see you. If you don't want people to see you, it's okay, but uh, I will be paying attention if you are not a hater, you know? So, yeah, uh, here I'm going to send you the link that you can copy that link and uh, copy it and paste it in your browser or, uh, yeah, Paste it in your browser, in your browser, and then you can be with me. If you want to say anything, you want to share some of your experience, you are very welcome. Uh, Q and A's are here for that, pretty much freestyle, but uh, as well trying to help you with your class. So don't forget Q and A questions. You get questions, just throw your questions. Thank you so much. Thanks, bro. So if you want to come. Andy, you're very welcome. <laughs> uh, hello from Tunisia. You, when you click on the link, I will see that you, 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 you'll be in a kind of waiting room. You will see me in, in a waiting room and you'll be able to, uh, I will let you know when you're going to go live with me, when you will be, when everybody will be able to see you. Thank you, Amal, for being in the chat. Hello from Tunisia. Welcome. Bienvenue. Hey, Mike. Yulia. Very welcome again. Thank you so much for being here. It's been a long time. Don't forget to give some likes and subscribe when if you are new in here. I'm from Vietnam. You're an energe uh, energetic teacher you were <laughs> last year. I taught banana song. Yeah, that's the most famous uh, on this on in the in the community and pretty much yeah, uh, very famous warm up as well on YouTube. When I started this YouTube, uh, my channel was really a niche. Uh, 
which means uh, people, uh, a YouTube channel that very few people do. <laughs> it's not like uh, you get very common cha channel on uh, on YouTube, like how to help you make money with YouTube. Yeah, that's one of the hot ones, and you get too much people on the, talking about this. So yeah, thanks, thanks a lot. Uh, welcome. I have peace on you, Mr. Mike. Thank you very much. I uh, very welcome. Peace on you too. Uh, Sammy Fortune, very welcome, brother. Hope you guys are doing good. Uh, wherever you are, and hope you everything's gonna get back to oh uh, your restaurant in a moment. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, you can share your restaurant. Uh, I'm in a restaurant at the moment, which is cool with StreamYard. You don't need a laptop. You can go just right away on your phone. It's just simple. No need of apps. You just have the link. Even for me, now what you're seeing, all my settings and all stuff, it's only from a link. Isn't that awesome? StreamYard is, for me, I've been trying StreamLab, I've been trying lots of other stuff, and StreamYard is really awesome. You can go and get uh, into the description down below if you want to know more about StreamYard, and you can get as well, uh, if you get some free, a free plan uh, so that you can try, but you will always have that, oops, you will always have that here. You can see that it's my logo because I... I pay for it uh, every month, it must be around um, $20 a month. And uh, if you want to get it for free, I, I started for free before, and you would see StreamLab logo. So you can go in the description and you can do your live just like me at home. And uh, you can even teach using S StreamYard as you can have some, uh, you can invite people till they get the link. It's a little bit like Zoom. Till you get the link, boom, you send the link to your friend. They're going to follow. Uh, they're going to ask you about your, your YouTube uh, or your Facebook uh, login. And then you'll be logged in very quickly. So that's really awesome. Hello, Mike. Saying hello to everybody. Thanks for being in here. Is it working? Okay. Hi, Kareem Twiwan. Thank you. Hello, brother. Thanks for being here. Really appreciate you. Uh, Amo Bemusa. My students really admire Bernana's warm up, and they always, always demand it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yesterday, I had a, I had a, in the live, I had a teacher who was saying, I forgot the name, I'm very sorry, who was saying, I gave a class, uh, he, he was saying, man, you're a lifesaver, because I had that class, and during the class, everything I've been teaching, kids wouldn't remember, except that peeled banana warm-up and the wrap-up. Boom, cha cha, boom, cha cha. Time is up. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, 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 oh yeah, yeah. We are free. We are free. Uh, when you see me jump in the intro of the ESL stream, is what, what we are doing. Uh, goodbye. With fun. Very important to finish your class with a lot of fun, especially if you are in a training center. Because the kids gonna go out and be very happy and excited, and dad and mom who's coming to fetch them is gonna be like, "Wow, cool," you know. And for sure, they're gonna stay with you two, three years at least. Thank you so much, brother, for being in here. <laughs> okay, so yeah, no, no need, no need. I think your wife would kill you. No, it's okay, it's okay. Your restaurant with uh, family, uh, yeah, I understand, I understand. I'm just, I, I was just kidding. I'm just saying if you 
if you would have the balls to do that. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, but whatever, you're, you're very welcome. You know, Chinese restaurant, my crazy loud and stream yard is amazing, though. That's for sure. Can't wait to. Oh, hello, Sally Fun. It's been a long time, brother. Thank you for uh, being back. <laughs> Here we go. Hi, Mike. Xavier here. How are you and your family? Thank you so much. I've seen a lot of your flows in China. Are the schools running our clothes now? No. Where I'm living here in China, uh, it's alive right in Xi'an, China. Uh, Xi'an is very famous for the Terracotta Warriors, you know, the Terracotta Army. Um, and it is the safest place on earth except if you're on the moon <laughs> but no well tell you what those emperors uh, there have been 13 dynasties of emperors in here and one of the older oldest uh, emperors were, uh, were from my wife's hometown which is in Fam famous a very famous temple where were the oldest emperors of China. Uh, we were kingdoms, of course, what, what we can say. And this place here in Xi'an is really safe. We are surrounded with mountains. And quite we are quite far from the mountains, about 30 kilometers. And uh, from north to... Uh, in the, we are uh, in the north. Uh, we are around like 30 kilometers far away from uh, from the mountains and the thousands is the same and we have a, a river as well but the river is isn't isn't that dangerous and uh, we are really peaceful for anything here this place all the foreigners who've been living in Xi'an will tell you it's a magical place it's the beginning of the silk road and believe me if you come to Xi'an you're gonna love it and this place is just awesome there are so many places in China that are really beautiful awesome uh, people are really nice it's not like what they're saying on the uh, uh, on the mainstream media those people mainstream media just doing bullshit it's political uh, but people we people and people from China we just they respect us a lot I've been to many countries in the world believe me and yeah China is really a peaceful I'm not saying this for, nobody paid me for saying that I've been here 20 years those two if you if you can accommodate in China you stay for life if not, you better go. You better go. It's better to go. Yeah, don't stay in a place where you don't feel good. I've seen many foreign teachers who were complaining all the time. Oh, why do they do this like that? You never expect that. It's going to be like home, right? Different culture, different world. But that difference is awesome because you can learn so many stuff. And difference is not a bad word. It's an awesome word. If this world... If it will be, everybody will, will be the same color. Everybody, if everybody will uh, have the same skin color, if everybody had the same culture, man, what a fucking boring life. Sorry. <laughs> what a boring world. I love to be with people with different culture. I can learn something. I can learn stuff every time. And that's why I got married to my wife who's Chinese. Because I, I keep on learning till today, since I've been 20 years in China. There's so many learn, many stuff to learn. And I love being with you because uh, we can speak Chinese, we can speak English all together. And you guys as well can just let me know about your culture. And it's all with that respect. And that's why we're teaching English. And that's the ESL power. Yeah. <laughs> So welcome to join the force. 
Hi, my guest. Have you? I'm so happy to be here. Don't worry. Everything is all right in here. Thanks. I'm really happy to see you. That's really cool. Uh, who's in here? Yeah, I was talking too much. I, I scared some people out. <laughs> uh, as a teacher, I need more warm-ups, especially new ones. Cool, I, uh, I roger that. And it's going to be coming. Don't worry. Um, I'm going to be back to school very soon. And this term, I got grade one and grade two. Wonderful. My favorite plan. My favorite planning. Down Ginny's. Uh, so happy to see you from New York. Thank you. Hope you're doing good and then you get your germs around. And just don't spread them <laughs> around. Hope you guys are doing better over there. I guess it's doing better, huh? Uh, but yeah. Uh, man, man, man. America is living historical part of its uh, man. Yeah, uh, really supporting you guys over there. Uh, stay safe. Uh, fight for your rights. And yeah, stay safe. And don't forget to your kids first. Students, keep on teaching, keep on doing. Uh, what you gotta do? All right. Oh, oh, science computer, how to teach? You are a lovely bear. <laughs> Thank you. No, I'm kidding. Uh, just kidding. Thank you, Minoy. Uh, this is an ESL. ESL means English as a second language. So uh, if you want me to teach English about science computer, uh, I've never tried that for sure, uh, to be true with you. And yeah, no, uh, no, I'm terrible at math and science IT, bro. Woo, push-ups. Uh, I hope some people can help you in the community. That would be cool. Just put, put your message into the comment section, not into the chat, not into the chat, but we'll be in the comment section and I, I'll try to find some people to help you for sure. Because, yeah, uh, nobody asked me those kind of questions, but thank you. And when you ask those questions, because you need help and we're going to find, uh, I, 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 got, I know a lot of people and yeah, uh, I can find you some guys who can help you. Uh, just let me know what you know, what you need, because this is quite uh, a big question. Science computer, how to teach? And I know I got no idea about science computer, bro. <laughs> bro. Hmm. Wow. I'm supposed to watch you. Wow. That's a cool. Thumb. That's the Joker. The 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 the, the Joker. Kidding. <laughs> Hi, Mike. Uh, should I ask uh, who's that from Reed Adam? Huh? Complete answer from first grade students, or answer like yes, I can. Enough. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, you can. Um, should I expect uh, complete answers from first grade? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, or answers like, yes, I can, enough. Yeah. Oh, well, you, know, you can say, yes, I can. I can swim very well. You know, you can do actions with that. I, uh, you can do actions, you can say, I can swim very well. Now, I forgot. I had an action for can. I forgot that one. Oh, man. Yeah, but you can uh, can. Yes, I can. Yes, I do. Make sure they know yes, I can and yes, I do. After, when you're going to, if they're going to say yes, I do, I like hamburgers. Um... 
probably can be a little bit difficult, but yeah, some kids can manage this grade one. I guess if you're in China, those students have been learning English for a long time. So I guess they, they, they're going to make it. They, they're going to be able. You just have to let them come in front of the class, uh, practice the dialogue, then they can play that game and in a fast pace, if you can. <laughs> Thank you so much for your question. Welcome, and don't forget to give some likes, guys, if you like. Put, get, uh, put your thumbs up, of course, if you don't like. You can put the thumbs down. It's going to make that, that live real, you know? Some people put thumbs down. Well, that's real. That's a real life, yeah. People like you, don't like you. Yeah, you all good. <laughs> Down Jennings is asking Eddie, Andy, hey, what are you eating? <laughs> okay, let me see other questions. Boo, 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 boo. Okay, it's a little bit slow. Have you started teaching? No, 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 I haven't started teaching. We're gonna be go back, we're gonna go back to class, like I say, here in, in China, in Xi'an. We ha are fine with the coronavirus. There's no problem. And if something bad happened right away. The, the next two hours, boom, everybody is just like, whew. social media, everybody is on it in, here in China, WeChat. If you come to China, just go for WeChat, guys. Uh, trying to answer your questions here, guys. Yeah, that was the first question. Okay. I'm teaching ESL students in grade two how to read. How to start with them giving me hints, please. Uh, if you started to teach them how to read, you better first make sure that they know their alphabet, uh, A, B, C, to Z, and especially the sound. For example, B says B, E says E, B, E, B, and then you add D, the letter D says Bad. Bad. Time to go to bed. No, not yet. Well, uh, that's for the example. Uh, start to uh, teach with the sound and make some simple, uh, you know, you, you teach them step by step, just like I did. And yes, I guess is, is the best way to start, especially for phonics. They have to know 26 letters sound, and there's not only 26 sound. There are a little bit more than that, if I can remember. I never get to count them, but there are quite a lot of sound. Uh, of course, because you get some uh, consonant clusters and uh, all uh, too many stuff. But I recommend you a book. Oh, I wish I would have that book here. Uh, let me think. I should have one book in here. Do we get that book in here, Mike? Do we get that book? Oh, I almost forget to bring it. Ah, uh, bad boy, bad boy. Yo! Some something almost fell, you guys. Yeah, let me check out if I get a book. If I get a that funny book. Yo, 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 yo. No, I don't have it. Well. So yeah, I, I, I think you guys have seen a light falling. <laughs> yeah all right so yeah uh better start like this okay thank you so much for the phonics yeah remember that 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 um what is it called uh 
Uncle Craig's Phonics is an awesome book for your class. Oh, I can see someone, Savvy Fan, who wants to be in a, in a live. That's cool. Uh, someone wants to come and join. That's cool. Great. Uh, we're going to be here all together, brother. As probably has been a moment that you've been waiting. Uh, but, yeah, we're going to go right away. Are you ready? Yeah? Okay. Here we go. So that's Savvy. Thank you, Savvy. Hello, brother. Hi, man. How are you? Welcome into, welcome into the live. Wait a moment. I'm going to get my... I gotta get my uh, headphones on. All right, brother, you doing good? Yeah, doing good. Yeah, how are you? Doing good. Great, good. thank you. Yes, thank you very much. So, can you tell us where are you from? Uh, pretty much for everybody to know you a little bit and what you're doing. I am. If you don't mind. I'm from India, basically, a place called Mumbai. So there I am teaching in a school for junior KG, senior KG. And then I'm teaching for higher secondary also. I am, I teach Great. Your sound, is, your sound is a little bit like, uh, blah, blah, not, the connection is not really, really good. Oh, yeah. That's a pity. So I teach phonics for the lower and for higher section, I teach computers and uh, social studies and English. Okay, so you're teaching, what, 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 what are you saying? For the junior and senior KG. Oh, okay. And for the higher section, I teach computers and then social studies, history, civics, geography. And also, I think. All right. For the higher sections. Okay. Yeah, because we had someone in the chat who was asking about uh, how to teach science computer. I, I guess it's uh, IT. How do you call that? There's a special name for that. Uh, must be IT, or he was asking. Uh, I'm looking for his. Uh, his name, because I get no idea how to teach English for the uh, you know science, computering, and all stuff. Can you can you help if it happens to be? He will have to hey, look no. at some uh, lower KG book, uh, lower standard book relating to computers, like basic things. Like, what is a computer? What is a CPU? So, right to that, he has to give them yeah. uh, knowledge of things, what they know, unknown, yeah. known to unknown. Okay. Yeah, brother, it's a pity because uh, your connection is, we can't really hear you very well. It's not easy, huh? From China yeah. to India and to yeah. all the world. But uh, a big shout out to you. Um, do do you want? Uh, did you have something special to say to everybody? You're doing a very good work, Mike. Very nice. It's a long thing, long time I've been listening to you and learning with from you. A lot of the banana song and lots of the homies <laughs> I learned from you. So thank you so much. Cool. You're you're very welcome. I hope uh, it's been very helpful uh, for you. And I know you've been uh, on the live uh, many times, and I haven't seen you since quite a long. So I was wondering, but yeah, uh, I was very happy to see you back on the live, and then you you coming right here. Thank you so much for for your support. Uh, Thank you, Savi. We're going to stop here because uh, we, connection is not really good. But thanks a lot, brother. Uh, we keep in touch, and you're always welcome into the live. 
Thank you, brother. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, that's always awesome when you get when you, you even if you want whatever you want to call what whatever you want to say, you, you just very welcome. And this is your place, your home. Uh, of course, the communication wasn't that good, so it was a little bit difficult to hear what he really wanted to say. But uh, yeah, that's that's awesome. Uh, if you want to join all others, you're very welcome. You get the, uh, the you, you still have the link. You got to go up a little bit and you can join. Let me check it out in here. All right. Uh, yeah, um, what I wanted to tell you as well uh, is what it was also about that for many of you, if you want to come to China to teach in China, wherever you're from, it's of course possible. Um, and what you're going to face when you're going to arrive in China is like the language is really different. So... <laughs> Uh, and, and even if you're from Europe, you know, a French guy will be able to understand a guy from Spain or Italy and vice versa. But here in China, it's just like when I arrived 20 years ago, I was like, what the hell are those guys saying? <laughs> so that was really, really difficult for me to understand. And of course, uh, uh, I'm a language lover, so I, I would keep on learning uh, i will keep on opening my ears and trying to ask uh, to people who could speak english to me i would ask them hey, what does it mean what does it mean this what does I, I would bother them 24 hours so um if you want to to learn chinese wherever you are in this world and especially if you want to join and come in china after i can help you as well with the coming in, in, into China, helping finding new school. Here, you can find, uh, I got a, a good friend called Karen. Uh, she's starting uh, her company and now she's got lots of, uh, what we can say, subscribers, lots of students learning Chinese with her. She's got a very good English and you will be able to have three different a uh, free class with her uh, is going to be a, about 19 minutes divided into three. So it's going to be 30 minutes each each day. I'm going to find the, uh, the, the, the picture for you to understand and see if you want to, uh, if you want to participate, you can uh, just uh, scan the QR code. Um, I've already sent this picture into the community uh, in my, on my channel. But if you want to learn English, you can go and learn with Karen. Uh, you can go and scan the QR code that you can see on the screen. Uh, if you cannot scan it from the screen, you can just, if you're not subscribed yet to my Mike Somia Sound, just subscribe. And when you are on my page, on my YouTube channel page, just go into community and you will see uh, her picture so that you can go and scroll. So you can see that on August 29th uh, at 10 a.m. in the morning, so it's going to be like uh, the day, a Saturday, night, a Saturday morning for people in China. But be careful, this is Chinese time, CST time. If you are uh, in, in America or in other countries in Europe, make sure to check the time. If it's in Europe, it must be around, uh, like for me, for France, it would be around 10, uh, 6 must be, it must be around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, if it's in America, it would be, uh, 10 p.m. 
but on tw on a on August twenty eighth. So make sure to check the time and just welcome. She's really awesome. She can speak English very well, and plus, uh, she's very charming. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm still mad. Yeah, I'm still mad. Yeah, you got some UFOs around me. You know, I hate that. Uh, okay, thanks. So you can go and check. Uh, check her out, check in the community if you want to uh, scan that QR code and if you want to learn Chinese just go She, she's it's an, you, you gotta download an app an app uh, and uh, so this is pretty much online teaching, so very convenient wherever you're from Thank you so much. What time it will be in India, brother? I got no idea. <laughs> I can still see you over there. Thank you. Uh, oops, sorry. Uh, I teach second grade students how to teach sight words. Oof, I never teach sight words. I, I don't put it on the table to students like, oh, this is sight word. Um, since I've been teaching 20 years in China, now it seems to be in, in like, uh, it seems to be really hard teaching sight words, sight words, but you don't have to pay that much attention on teaching sight words. Kids gonna, is gonna, they have so many stuff to learn in English. Don't bother them with giving a name to those words, sight words. <clears throat> Sorry. So, yeah, you just teach when they appear, just don't mention them as sight words. Uh, you can mention them when they get older, but yeah, no, not too much trouble for them. Thank you very much, anyway, uh, for uh, Sarah Chud, for your question. Really appreciate you. Thanks. And thanks, thanks a lot. I think there are 44 sound. Yeah, you see, I was right. Yeah, phonics. Uh, I don't want to hint the vowel letters as they make their uh, confuse the difference between. Uh, oh, yes. E, because E has different sounds for sure. And I, yeah. I uh, is very easy. You can say to your students when they pronounce I, it's not I when they pronounce the sound. If the tongue in the mouth is not touching anything is just floating in your mouth it doesn't touch the upper part it doesn't touch your down it's just in the middle oh that's a, I, I thought that was a ufo but that's a oh uh, come with me huh where is she oh she's here <laughs> Or talking about um, talking about what do we call that? Uh, talking about phonics when we teach the letter L, you always have that ladybug. So I got I got a ladybug with me. I don't know if you can if you can see it, of course, because it's a bit too close. But I got a ladybug. She's not that red. She, she's a little bit yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I, Keep you on the apple. All right. She's here with us. Cool. I love ladybirds. Oh, she's back on the light. Okay. Um, great. So, um, yes, your tongue, just not touch, touching anything in your mouth. It, kid. Sometimes I do make mistakes when I say kids, it's just because of my French accent. But... You're supposed to say kids, 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 ki kids. Just have to train at home, it's gonna come. And E says eh, elephant. And just bring them some words, they're gonna understand. And then E, oh yeah, I was talking about E. The ladybug is an insect. Yeah, right. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, I would like to learn Chinese too. So you're welcome. And yeah, check Karen out. 
Uh, if you're not subscribed yet, you can subscribe. And like I say, you will see in the community lab uh, that you can uh, you can scan if you have WeChat or any, any other application. You just use, uh, you know, with your phone, you scan a QR code and then you it will help you to uh, you will just follow the steps and it's going to be OK so that you can attend those free lessons the three days that are coming then after uh i forgot they they must have some payments for special lessons if you are really serious about it so if you want to uh, really check out how she teaches just go and check it out i'm just helping here thank you iris right in the house I would like, uh, hey Mike, so helpful you are with the warm up lately. Kids enjoying it so much. Thank you so much, Iris. It's been a long time as well, Iris. Uh, good to see you again. A little shout out. So, if you join as a member, like you see in this video down here, you get that join button. If you join, uh, it's gonna be like two dollars a month to be helping me and keeping on creating some stuff for you because I got more and more work to do and I'm still alone, but I need to employ some freelancer to do some, some jobs. So even if you have some video uh, power, <laughs> if you are, if you can, if you can work on video and all stuff, you're welcome to contact me and be part of the family. But here, if you want to help be uh, you can, you can have some, uh, perks, uh, lots of stuff like special lives for members only if you really need help with your class. And yeah, some shout outs like when you arrive into the live, into the live, you will have your name with a special Mike's Home uh, uh, icon near your name. And I will be like, <laughs> Welcome to you. <laughs> That's the hype. You. Yeah. All right. So welcome. Uh, thanks. It's been a long time. I just hope you're doing good. Um, so yeah, uh, I wanted to share something with you as well because uh, I know it's going to be in China. It's going to be demo time, or it's already the demo time. What is demo time? Is demonstration class. And what is a demonstration class? It's um, a class where you have to demonstrate how good you are at teaching to the parents and students. So uh, many people will be uh, coming into the classroom, the parents, the kids will be in the classroom waiting for you. Uh, waiting for the demo to start. And what I like to do uh, once uh, that was back in 2010, we changed a little bit the rules of those demos by uh, doing like, you, you're going to see, I'm going to show the show you the video. It's on Microsoft ESL, but you cannot see it because of, you know, YouTube algorithm. But I'm going to show you uh, that's one of the very first videos I've made. I started to make videos back in 2010, but that wasn't for YouTube. That was for my demo class uh, into the school. So what was the idea? Uh, in fact, the demo class will start without me in the classroom. But as in all the, in the training centers, you know, that was in the training centers, as in training centers, you get screens where, uh, where you can share some videos. So the TA, my assistant teacher would be like, Hey, what is Mike doing in front of everybody in front of the parents and the parents, the kid will be waiting for, well, where's the foreign teacher? And then she would be like, yeah, what is Mike doing? He's late. And then she would, like if she was giving a phone call, 
And when she started talk, I will appear on the screen answering her phone call. But before that, the parent, the, 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 you, you'll see how it works. I'm going to show you right away how to start your class in a different way. And we were two foreign teachers doing demos at the same time. So the parents who would come into the school, into the training center, would know that we were doing uh, a demo. There were two demos, demos for this age and uh, the other age, or they were the same age. Well, uh, so you will see one of my very awesome brother called, his name is Eddie. Uh, he's from Australia. Uh, we used to work all together. The, he's an awesome teacher. He used to be an awesome teacher. Now he's in Belgium. Uh, he's in Europe. And he left uh, China. Uh, that was like four or five years ago. Well, anyways, I'm going to share my screen. Uh, so I just want to say, AD, I love you, brother. I miss you so much. Uh, would be fun if he was with me. Doing that Mike saw me yourself would be something really, really crazy awesome because we had that idea all together. Uh, so let's share my screen where it is. Here it is for you guys. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see. Yes, here we go with... Uh, I skipped the um, I skipped the intro the intro, so we're gonna you're gonna hear me as well commenting the the demo this uh, uh, video. So here we go. All right, so here we go. We're gonna start with Eddie's demo. Like I said, in the park, he's having fun. This is my son over there. And at this time, the TA in the classroom will pick up the phone yeah. and call him. Ah, do I have to? Yeah, uh, she would say it's time for okay, class. You gotta come to class right, right away. So he's gotta go. Bye bye. But yeah, my son doesn't want him to go as well, and he's not going. Yeah, Eddie is a little boy. Eddie the boy. He's playing, having fun. <laughs> yeah, we are assholes sometimes. No, oh, it's good fun. The slide. Oh. <laughs> oh <my. laughs> Another slide because he had to take slide, seesaw, and the swing. So it's like, eh, I gotta go. Oh no, I just want to play. Come on. Yeah, forget the time. Let's play. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, we had so much fun filming this. Oh, another phone call from the TA in the classroom where the yes. parents are. Mm, really? So she would say, okay. The parents are coming. Like, yeah, the parents are waiting for you. So he's going to go. And so he is going. Still, my old bike that I had that time. That was good fun. <laughs> that bike helped me so much. In China, when you get an e bike, it's awesome. He's going, and my son is following him. <laughs> uh, he would love to play. 
more for sure <laughs> and he's gone now we're gonna see my demo the beginning as well i'm in a supermarket and here's that asshole sorry mm -hmm. candies i had to teach candy uh candy cookie then I got a phone call from my, as well, TA, yeah. and she would say, Mike, you gotta go to class, it's time. Yeah, it's time, come on. Yeah, you gotta go, come. Okay, okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh my, Mike was hungry, he wanted to have some cookies. Yeah, good stuff. Cookies. Yeah. People in I had more, more here. here. I was crazy. <laughs> I gotta get go for juice, juice, yeah. Mm, juice. Look at the woman behind. Her. She's gonna. I'm gonna scare her. Yeah, she. Oh, another phone call. So it's really time to go. Yeah. Okay, I'm coming. Everybody's with. Me. Okay, I'm coming. So it's still the TA calling me. Well, of course, during this time, I would be, for real time, I, I would be in the school, uh, in a corner of the school, watching the parents, watching this. And you will see why I, uh, I would do that. So now, it's time to go to school, right? Fat ass. <laughs> Here we go on the bike, say the bike, yeah. Did you say that? The people would be starting at the same time in two different classrooms, so it doesn't matter if the bike is the same. And now that's the meeting with Santa. Oh my. What a meeting. Oh, so exciting. You bump into Santa. Yeah. It's not every day. Yeah, but he's busy. He's gonna go there. Now it's my. It's me. That was it before. Now it's my meeting center. Yeah. This one was a skinny center. Uh, Mike, like Eddie, is busy, he's got to go to school. And now they're on the way to school. Oh, that was something when I filmed this. I filmed this on my bike, you know, with a stupid little camera. That was, uh, that was fun, but yeah. Just to give a, just to let the, the story go on, going on. Uh, it's gonna get tough. Oh, 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 the bus. Of course, it was very slow. Then uh, we arrive at the school. Eddie is arriving. I know that's me first. I almost bumped into that car. Crazy time. And then we get right into the elevator. Going to the school. Eddie is arriving. Lucky him. No car. And 
not like you had all no other So both of us are lying. I was like, what the hell? What the hell are you? What the hell are you? What the hell are you? What the hell are Well, I gotta stop here because <laughs> you can hear and say, Well, I kill Santa. Yeah, it went like, I kill Santa. And then I was like, There's not things we have to do, we have to save for Christmas party. <laughs> and then I say, Yeah, you kill Santa too. Uh, all right, uh, we didn't cut that part because we guessed that the parents wouldn't understand and uh, on the video that we uh, because I'm re-editing uh, re in here so uh, I let you hear what we were saying but on the other video I would let the music a little bit high I would put the music the volume higher that the the parents couldn't hear what we were saying yeah because uh, oh, you kill Santa I kill yeah me too I guess how can we both kill Santa so like, yeah, that wasn't good for a demonstration in Christmas. It was quite fun, but yeah, no, yeah. So let's go on. So he's gonna, I'm gonna go to my class, knock, and he's gonna go to his class, knocking. So. At this time, we enter the classroom and then the kids are... Yeah, so we're going to stop here. I hope you guys... <coughs> that was quite something, believe me. Uh, that was... Uh, yeah, of course, sorry for that. I know it's not good quality video, but the idea uh, was really awesome, especially back into... Uh, was... Oh, yeah, almost 10 years ago in, in a training center, doing this was re really, really different. And we just wanted to give it a try. And yeah, the parents were like, yeah, cool. That was awesome. And the kids were like, huh? oh, you've seen Santa. Yeah, we've seen Santa, but they never knew <laughs> that. And he would be like, yeah, we killed Santa. No, 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 no. You can't say that for Christmas party, <laughs> especially in a training center. Uh, or especially for any kind of parties you're bringing up on the, you know? But yeah, that was, uh, yeah, uh, that was quite funny. So that's that was another way to start uh, your class, when you have so much awesome tools in your hands, why not doing it? Why not? You can do many stories here. Obviously, you had to teach in my class cookies, juice, uh, all the things uh, I, I really wanted to eat when I was in the supermarket, just like for Eddie when he was playing on the swing, slide, and... Um, uh, what was that? The, uh, the CISO. So that was mostly in a demo class. You teach at least three, four words. Uh, so that was really a good presentation of your ESL class. Even if you look at it and you say, oh, that's retarded. Oh, man, you, you guys are retarded. No, it's not retarded. For kids, it's not like... And then when you knock at the door and you enter the classroom... I remember all the students were like, oh, that's it. Yeah, this is it. Oh. They were like in another world, you know? They were, they really thought that all oh, happened before was really, hap was really happening. And yeah, you, that was a hundred person sign up, believe me. All the parents signed. <laughs> so, uh, I've never tried it again with better tools. I had a very shitty camera, believe me. It was like uh, 700, 700 to 
48 and he beat. So um, you can't imagine. That was a terrible camera. But uh, I think I still have it. I'm not sure. But, yeah, uh, that was <laughs> – I, I didn't have that what you get, you know, that, that GoPro – GoPro old stuff. He GoPro wasn't wasn't on the market yet. Back was that? Yeah, that was back in 2010. So yeah, good fun, good ideas for you that you can use as well in your training center. Uh, that that one was a good one for sure. Believe me. So thanks uh, for you for. Yeah, uh, I wasn't sure as well for, uh, yeah, yeah, that's, a, I, I don't know what I'm saying right now. <laughs> yeah, just checking your message out. Uh, cool. Thanks a lot to, for all of you guys for being in the chat. I uh, hope the connection was good. We're going to stop for here for today. Uh, remember that if you really want to learn Chinese, just welcome to go on and yeah, you know, it will, learning Chinese will help you feel better, especially if you want to come in China to teach. Uh, so make sure to go in here, to go on my friends, Karen, uh, it's called Q Sky ABC. So you can go and check the uh, and check out her free lessons. So yeah, you can go and check. It's all free. So uh, that's uh, that's cool. Just help you out uh, for you to have a, a better life as a teacher because it's not only tips. It's also everyday life. And believe me, on my some online courses is going to happen uh, very soon. I'm going to be here with you giving all my single tips to help you with your life, your class, and everything. Whatever happened on the way, even if you get problems with your school, I got some people with you to get your back some lawyers that can help you and make it fair for everyone. So thanks a lot for being in the live, all of you. If you are new in here, don't forget to give some likes. Just give some likes to help me and help the community. If you really like my channel, I guess you guys know uh, that you can give some likes. Thanks a lot for all of you being in here, uh, whatever, if you join or you not do not join that uh, My Somia Self family, you are always welcome and never is going to be changing on My Somia Self. I'll be here probably tomorrow night. I hope so, for sure. Uh, Saturday, Sunday, we'll see. And yeah, because I, I have some some videos as well. You know, uh, well, I'll show you on this Saturday, Sunday. Uh, time is up. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. You guys are free, and me too. Uh, thanks for being in the live on Mike's Home ESL, the ESL live stream. Hope you like it. If you like it, give some likes. Thanks to our brother Savy for being in the live with us. Can't stop saying thanks. Uh, it was just because you guys are really awesome. So thank you so much uh, for being in the live. And yes, just feel free to join. It will be really cool. So, uh, yeah, uh, it's going to be all for today. That was the ESL live stream, the 62 ESL live stream. Of course, it's not in a row. 
Some of them are in a row, others are not in a row, because I'm working, I'm not in a quarantine, but that was awesome to be with you. Thank you so much, guys. Really appreciate. Remember, ESL power, together, we're the stronger. Thank you, guys. Really appreciate you. See you in another live. Thank you. Thank you, Savy. Bye, bye, bye. Bye. Thank you, brother. Bye. Take care, Mike. Thanks for being in here. Bye. Awesome. Thank you, bye. Take care. See you soon, brother. Thank you. Take care.